Arjuna, verily yoga is not for one who eats too much or who does not eat at all, nor for him who sleeps too much or who does not sleep at all. For him who is moderate in food and recreation, moderate in exertion, in all actions, moderate in sleep and wakefulness, yoga destroys all pain and suffering caused by birth and death. When the perfectly controlled mind rests in the self, free from longing for all enjoyments, then one is said to have attained yoga. Just as a lamp in a windless place does not flicker, so the disciplined mind of a yogi remains steady in meditation on the self. Where the mind rests restrained by the practice of yoga and where the self seeing, the self is delighted in the self and where established the yogi knows that bliss which transcends the senses which is understandable by the purified intellect only and from the experience of self does not even move possessing which he does not think any other gain greater than that in which established he is not shaken even by great sorrow that should be known by the term yoga and that yoga which is free from sorrow should be attained by the undesponding and determined mind.